in this lesson, we're going to take a look at the page block, the contacts page block. So you click on contacts here. Once again, the page blocks, uh, this is the pro or the bro version. So if you have the free version, you're not going to get access to this. So you have to upgrade in order for you to get this. So if you're not able to see that, that's okay. Just upgrade it, which is definitely worth it. I recommend it 125 bazillion percent to upgrade it. So let's go over to the contacts and let's say you want to i'm just going to drag this one over and you can change some stuff here with the maps you can put your um, api key you have to go to google to get your api key and you put that here and then it's going to give you the location um, on this part and you can be able to choose do you want the theme to be dark standard so as you choose there it's kind of going through there but you have to get that api key first from google in order for you to see the map so once again, you have the option here, contact us, or you can put contact me, and you can change whatever this says right here by either just clicking to edit, or you can put your mouse over here, you click this pencil icon, and you can be able to choose to edit from here. You can choose the color, you can choose different things here. Uh, you can choose the icon, if you wanna change the icon, you choose the smartphone, you just go back here, and choose that alarm so I've just changed from a phone to an alarm you can put your phone number there you can put the working hours so let's say I'm done with this one and also you can choose the layout and the design to change that if you want to change the background color for this you go over to this here you click on to edit and let's go to background and I want this to be a gradient so I'm going to choose that gradient and I want to choose that you can change the angle here and as I'm moving the mouse, notice that the angle where the light comes from changes too. And I want to choose the start color, opacity to put that up or put it down. And I want to choose the end in color or the end color. And I'm going to choose something like that. And that changes that. And once you're done, just click that X out. So you're done with this one. I'm going to X that off. Let's say I want to pick something else. I'm going to go over to the contacts again and I can pretty much just pick and choose any one of these that I want. So this is the one that I want to go with. Or I can come back and say, you know what, let me just change and I want to go with this one. And you add that on there. And you give, you know, it gives you that. So that's how you add the contact page block. It gives you so much flexibility and saves you a lot, a lot of time with that.